All right, here is the first team from Salutum. Please welcome Ms. Sharon Barrack. Good afternoon, everyone. So excited to be here today. My name is Sharon Barak. I am the founder and CTO of Solitum. I actually want to start by showing you the planet as we all know it today. This is the map with the continent, the oceans. This is actually taken from NASA's website. For the past 60 years, mankind has successfully changed our planet. And currently today we have five plastic islands floating in our ocean. Islands made entirely out of plastic, thrown away to our environment. The size of each island is about twice the size of Texas. So, Houston, we have a big problem. Where does all this plastic come from? Each year, we produce around 400 million tons of plastic. Let's dive into the slide and understand the problem. So we saw the plastic islands. Because of the plastic islands, we have found microplastic within fish. Recently, we have found microplastic within human blood. There is regulation today, but it doesn't accelerate the problem fast enough. Because currently today, we spend around $3.7 trillion on the plastic problems. Just imagine, we're talking about making life good. What can we make with $3.7 trillion shifting from the plastic problems to other solutions, to other benefits? The problem today is there is no good enough solution to plastic, cost-effective enough and scalable enough. Plastic is here around, around 60, 70 years. You can see how it accelerated during the, the, during the past years since we just invented it. It started back then in 1950, and here the gray area is approximately 2023. You can see 400 million tons. If we continue producing plastic at this rate, 2050, this is where we're going to be, floated with plastic. One of the plastic single-use products that we are all well known, or some of us know very well, are diapers. Diapers made out of plastic. Here you can see how much, how many diapers one baby needs for one year. And we all know how many diapers we have today. One possible way to get rid of these diapers is to use reusable diapers on the other sides of the picture. This can replace those diapers. Now you probably ask yourself, but today, who will use those reusable diapers? It's so comfortable to use those single diapers, although it does make a lot of damage to the environment. So, this is my baby Ari. He is being saving the environment from the first day he was born. We are only using reusable diapers. In fact, we are only using reusable everything. At home, we don't use any single plastic. This is how I started. This is how I started caring about the environment. It came to me in recent years. I wasn't like this in the beginning. But a few years ago, I kind of realized where we are heading. And I said, OK, I'm not going to use this. This is something I'm, I really take inside. And really, my family support it. And this is what we do. But it's not enough. Change needs to be much, much bigger. I'm a chemical engineer. I actually used to be the R&D manager at the plastic company. It was over there I realized the phenomena, the magnitude of what we are facing. Yes, plastic is a great product. I do believe so. But the way we are using it today won't take us anywhere. And what are we leaving for our kids? And I love this sentence. Be the change you wish to see in the world. This is what I decided to do. Five years ago, I quit my job. I had a great job, really. But I decided to quit it. And I started Solitum. Our vision? 
to eliminate plastic waste for good. How are we going to do that? We have invented this material that on one hand feels and looks like plastic, but once it comes in contact with water, it will dissolve and biodegrade. And I'm going to do some magic here today, so bear with me. This is a film, I hope you can see it. And when I put it in water, don't know if in the back you can see it very well, but pay attention. So you can see it starts to disappear. So this will eliminate the plastic islands that we have today. So this is how we started. I think it's pretty cool, I love it. But there, you are very limited with what you can do with plastic that dissolves in water. So what we did, we took it to the next step and we developed a unique mechanism that allows us to control how sensitive our material are to water. So we have products today already scaled, already in the market, that are much more durable to water. Because a friend of mine asked me, Sharon, great, but what will you do if it's a rainy day and I want to go take your bag outside? So this is exactly what we did. And with a special IP and special development that we did, you can apply it, we can apply it, and actually replace all kinds of single-use plastic product to start with. This is the first product that we have developed. We developed it with Colgate, our design partner. This is a poly bag for their merchandisers. And I really like this one. First of all, I really enjoyed working with Colgate. But uh, more than that, at the, at, the, at the bottom of the bag, you can see that there is a QR code, QR barcode. You can scan it. And with your family at home, you can go to the web page and see how in a safely and responsibly and a sustainable way you can get rid of it. The next product that we are working with Colgate is to replace their toothbrush packaging. Colgate is selling approximately 3 billion toothbrush a year. So replacing the packaging has a huge impact. Now we have the ability to control all kinds of different properties of the product. So you saw the plastic bag. Now this is a whole new product. This is something different. This is a stretch film being used to wrap pellets and to shift it wherever you want. Almost all companies today are using this kind of stretch film. And here, this one we have developed with AB InBev, specifically with their Corona beer brand. And you can see, oh, the video didn't. But believe me, it's already working on the production lines. Why did, we start, why did we decide to start with those, with those two products? I mean, we have a replacement for plastic. We can go and do whatever kind of plastic we want. But we specifically target the thin film flexible packaging. And this is why. Rigid plastic, all kinds of different plastic, even bottles are being recycled today at some kind of percentage. Thin film packaging, almost not at all. Some in Europe, a little bit in Canada. But when we're looking at the entire planet, almost zero percentage of those packaging is being recycled. That means it stays in our environment. And those flexible packaging are in charge of more than 80% of the plastic leakage to the ocean. So obviously, the problem is huge, and we need to find a solution now. One of the things that was very important for us when we are looking at to replace plastic is there are so many facilities all over the world to manufacture plastic, to manufacture plastic products. We thought we want to integrate to the same existing plastic machinery lines. And this is what we are doing. We are using available raw material from the market. We are manufacturing our products on existing plastic products machine which means we, instead of using plastic raw material, you use solid tomb raw material, and in the end, you get a product which is environmentally friendly, and from there, obviously, to the rest of the world. We are looking at a holistic approach to the end of life. Yes, our claim to fame is water biodegradable. We have reached those standards. We can claim that we are water biodegradable, both in a managed environment and an unmanaged environment. So if the product ends up in the environment, we, we got it. We take over it. Also, by the way, in soil. But then as, as we matured and we started discussing it with our clients, with all different kinds of places in the world, we understood that we need to find other solutions as well to other end-of-life scenario. 
So we worked on it, and currently today at the, at the managed environment, our materials can be composted, home composting, industrial composting. At the existing recy the plastic recycling stream, they won't interfere it, because when you're recycling plastic, you wash it with a lot of water, and our products will dissolve. It has a very high calorimetic value, so it can go to incineration to generate energy. And looking to the future, being collected properly, it can actually be used to a second product, let's say as binder for the paint industry, and by that we are creating a circular economy. Oh, you, we, we saw this today, right? Super important. And I loved all the lectures before. We in our company has our value almost from day one, sustainability obviously is one of them, um, diversity and some more. When we are looking at the sustainable development goals, we have 17. We at Solitum contribute to six out of those 17, some directly by replacing plastic, some by other ways, but this is our way to have a huge impact on the environment. We believe in leave no trace. This is why we made this disappearing product. We don't want to leave anything behind us. We want to have a clean environment to the next generation. And this is why I'm going to take this opportunity and I have three asks to ask from you, respectful audience. First, pay attention. When you're buying all kinds of different products, when you're using single-use product, pay attention. Have a look if those packaging are environmentally friendly. Think maybe you can take a reusable cup instead of single-use cup. The enormous impact that will have can make a difference. Yes, every single one of us can make a difference. So it's starting by paying attention. Second, please use your influence to spread the world. First with your family, then with your community. Then maybe with Instagram or TikTok. I heard this is what's going on today. Um, you know, post, I heard that there is a dissolvable plastic. Let's take care about the environment. This is cool. This is very cool to take care about the environment. And third, well, this is an opportunity to speak with such an important people from all kinds of places here in LG, and I'm sure many more. Use your force, your power to spread, to your power to make a difference. If we, can, if we can help implement all kinds of solution in the company, if you have connections to the government, any way we can speed up the process, that will be super helpful. This is our vision, to have a clean ocean once again. I welcome you to help us and join us in our journey. Thank you so much. <laughs>